show you my fucking seat. This looks, looks flat enough to me. Yeah, yeah, this will do. I'll go get the dog. All right, this is pretty exciting. I'm out here winter camping with Jay Kelly Nolan. Definitely check out his YouTube if you haven't. He was, uh, he's been an inspiration to me. Uh, when I first started, I was definitely watching his videos, watching him uh, uh, trout fish in the Adirondacks, winter camp out of his snow trek or hot tent in the Adirondacks. I learned, learned a lot of skills from him. So this is the first time him and I are teaming up camping together. We're going to be doing some ice fishing out here and uh, two days of snowshoe hare hunting. So we, we've both been really looking forward to that. We've got a Adirondack Mountain and Stream Guide Outfitters uh, that's going to be taking us out. So we'll probably see Jamie tomorrow, uh, the owner, or maybe Cody uh, with some beagles who will be running around the forest and uh, helping us to find those snowshoes. We just pulled, uh, or... We didn't pull sled. We used the snow dog to uh, come on into camp and uh, pack down and put down a pad for the snow trekker. So we're going to let this snow sinter and harden. And uh, we'll go back, we'll get our gear and uh, set up camp. There's, there's either the, the white ones or there's uh in the in between there's uh other ones. Can I go through the loop? Alright. Give a couple give me a couple pulls from over here. Try this one here. And this one. Okay. Right, I think we're good. Under and under and and then down through and that that's what gotcha. so essentially you're strapped in as long as you got everything tight that's what ties it I don't know about this. What what uh snow trekker do you have here? What size? Yeah. Uh, it's an oddball. It's a eight by twelve. Oh. They don't make them like that. It was, it was an early model. Yeah. Would you call that a short wall or no? It's oh, just it's a, a crew. Crew. Snow trekker crew. Neat. Yeah, I've had it for you know, 10 or 12 years anyways. It was a, a 2000, yeah, 2008, I think, is on the model. Oh, yeah, on the tag. They, they put a model number on all their, uh, yeah. or a serial number on all their uh, tents. Yeah. 
Nice. Total slush under there, and then the uh, windswept lake just blew snow right into the hole. I had one tip up go off, and the bait is gone. So that's a good sign. corner say uh out east east of where you'll end up on the little bump there and wandered out in there sometimes you got a rabbit luke when he came back toward the creek and came back toward you guys you're going to get a shot but he just got out of your reach Bio bricks, I, I put one on one side, sort of then it well, fell in the trough, so I'll have to move it. One on the other, and I'll create a, a V shape like this. Yeah. And then I'll take a third one put on top. and put it on top. So, yeah. it, and, and, I'll, and I'll lay it. Yes. I'll lay it diagonal. That's all it takes. So then you. I got that hole there. Yeah. And then yeah. I'm just gonna open this up, close this, yeah. and take the oh, the bellows. Yeah. The minute it yeah it it, it would it would bite on its own, but it would just take so long. Yeah. And and once you get a flame, there's nothing I need to do.
day two hare hunting. Uh, we saw an incredible amount of tracks yesterday, and the dogs had some great runs. Um, we're hoping for more luck today. Uh, Kelly Nolan did see one yesterday. It bounded right at him, but uh, no shots fired. So we'll see. We'll see what happens today. Looks like a beautiful day. Yeah, we'll just keep moving, Frank. I think uh, probably picking up the from where, where a rabbit sits is time. We'll see if the rabbit's ahead of us. Careful. Yeah, he, he yipped a couple times walking through the woods. Well, I saw one bound across the flow. And then uh, just through the tiniest little bit of brush, I did see that black eye. But uh, that was the first snowshoe I've ever seen in my life. So I didn't, uh, didn't pull the trigger. Should have. I will next time. Happen awfully fast. Uh, but uh, hey, that's a, that's a step forward. I lost my hat on the snow dog ride. I think Dave's going to want a snow dog. Oh, oh, oh no. Whoops. Oh, took a spill. hard to uh, drive and film at the same time. So we, what do we, we got some meatballs and spaghetti for dinner. We had some last night, but there's some left over. We're probably going to make up some venison. I've got some, uh, some like refried beans to add to that. Maybe a pot of nor rice. But, uh, start of the appetizer is some, some of those, uh, delicious meatballs and some bread, uh, just heating up right now. 
And this is hors d'oeuvres. All right, meatball sub. Meatball sub. Oh, you're loading me up? Thank you. One more meatball, and then there's a plenty of sauce. I'll, I'll, take, I'll take a scoop of sauce if you can do that. Get as much sauce as we can. How much sauce? Woo! Let's do this. <laughs> How much sauce? <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Is that enough sauce? Uh, one more on the end. Which end? Um, closer to me. All right, yeah, excellent. brother. Excellent. Venison tenderloin. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Excellent.